Hello everyone, my name is Madhav Sal. Welcome to Gyan Shalal University. So today we will be talking about jellyfish and their stings. So as you know, jellyfish sting their prey to escape from them and even feed on the small creatures. So let us talk about them. But first, we will learn about jellyfish. First is that jellyfish is not a fish. It is an invertebrate and it is uh, so it does not have a backbone and it takes oxygen not from any type of gills because uh, the fish always takes oxygen from the gills but jellyfish is not a fish so it does not take oxygen from the gills it just absorbs the oxygen from the water, uh, water and takes in so basically is it's just direct like in plants tomato is there in jellyfish uh, there are many cell membranes and many other things are there, but they do not take uh, oxygen through gills. So, they are not a type of fish. Now, we will talk about stingers. So, basically stingers are present in the tentacle-like structures which are below the jellyfish body and on their jelly-like uh, substance which is there on the top of their head. So, that is also made up of 90% water. So, it is very jelly-like. And that also has stringers sometimes, but usually the tentacles have string, uh, stringers. Uh, stingers. So let us talk about them. So stingers basically are made up of something called nidocytes. So basically those stingers are nidocytes. And what happens is that whenever something comes in contact with them, like our skin comes in contact with them, so they have kind of uh, some sensing receptor so when it comes in contact and the stinger goes inside so what happens is that water comes in the uh, nidocyte so basically uh, the jellyfish is always in a water only so whenever it will attack it will be in water so when it will attack then a small valve will open which will allow the water to enter inside and if the uh, water enters inside, then there is a pressure change which allows the stinger which is inside the nidocyte to go into the person's body and inject poison in it. So basically that's the basic process of stinging. And this can be fatal sometimes but usually it is not and you can treat it with vinegar. So uh, whenever a jellyfish stings you, so it will cause uh, red rashes so you can pour vinegar on it to uh, cure it and you should never put water on it because water uh, is like if you pour water on it then the same thing will happen as it happened inside the water the water will flood in and the poison will go inside the body or body any any sea creature also so you should never pour water on it you should pour vinegar and the box jellyfish, it, uh, it is said to have one of the most deadliest sting and you sh if you spot a box jellyfish and you get stinged by it, then you should go to hospital ASAP. So please like and share this video and please subscribe to this channel also. Bye.